The landlord has just been crappy, for lack of a better word. Like when things need to get. Oh, I went through it in December, and I was I was mad. I was mad. I think end of November to beginning of December, a part of my house was leaking, and just the basic thing. I'm like, I don't understand. I'm flipping paying rent, and you people are not doing your shit. And I I was so pissed. And at that point, I made up my mind. hi beautiful people yes it's been a very long time i haven't vlogged in months at this point i think the last time i vlogged maybe somewhere in december it's a very long while later it's a few months later and i honestly like a lot a lot has happened they've all been good by the way but uh, I've decided to, this year, hold a lot of things to my chest. I just felt like I was putting myself out there too much. And I'm just drawing back. And I, I'm just deciding, or I've decided that, I honestly decided that this year, I'm not going to like do vlogs. It will be more of sit-down videos, which I think I've mentioned at some point. But anywho, guys, welcome back to another vlog. I'm doing this vlog because... I just feel like there's something interesting going on and i feel like i want my channel to be educative so um hopefully you guys can pick up a few things i have so much to tell you guys in terms of what is going on in my life at the moment so i am moving houses oh god i've said it out i have started in fact i've started moving already i yeah i got the keys to my new place last week friday and i did the cleaning last weekend and this throughout the week i've just been taking stuffs from this place to the new place i have roughly about a week and a few days left in this new place before i have to return the keys so i can get my bond back but like there's so much so much to talk about when it comes to like moving houses expenses like unbudgeted expenses like even the new place i'm already spending money i said money money which should not be what i am doing but yeah my background is a mess because are you know are you even moving if it's not a mess by the way guys my name is lola if you're new to my channel welcome 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 lola lelita if you're new here okay but yeah i am in the middle of moving i'm just trying to figure out i've cooked my last meal <laughs> in this house i will say yeah I've, I've cooked the last meal at this point um yesterday today's sunday anyway and i've just gotten off the bed i i'm exhausted like i haven't taken time off work by the way it's just been going to work coming back packing things taking them to the new place i still need to get movers right so they call them removal list movers so i need like my bed my couch my fridge my washing machine and all of those stuff to get moved from here to the new place <sighs> I don't think there'll be a house though. I'm sorry. It's just one of those things we have decided. Because even here, Seth, I didn't even do furnished apartment though. I only did house though for you. That was like over a year ago. So I've lived here for like 18 months now. One year and a half. And they're selling the property. And that's why I'm not able to extend my lease. Because I honestly wanted to leave this place. One, because um, the landlord has just been crappy. For lack of a better word like when things need to get oh i went through it in december and i was i was mad i was mad i think end of november to beginning of december a part of my house was leaking and just the basic thing i'm like i don't understand i'm flipping paying rent and you people are not doing your shit and i, I was so pissed and at that point i made up my mind because my lease is expiring in march and i was like nah after this i'm done but like i traveled i came back and it was just like everything was happening at once and i was just i was like this is too much i can't do this i can't do this and i was a part of me was like ah maybe i should stay a little more and then move later but i guess god had other plans and yeah i'll do a sit down video to tell you how i got the new apartment blah 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 and all of that in case you need accommodation there are videos about accommodation on the channel already so let me know if you're interested in a sit down video about moving houses blah 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 but anyway today is sunday i was at the new place the old day yesterday but i didn't film for youtube follow me on instagram follow me on tiktok i feel like some of this content would be more on there 
than on YouTube just because YouTube is just stressing me out. Engagement has plummeted. It has dropped totally. And I'm talking too much. Anyway, I'll be, I think I, I have an idea about how my intro will be. Uh, I'll be talking throughout the video. But yeah, the whole house is a hot mess. My bedroom, I've sold a few items. I sold my wardrobe because I got that and my cube that I used to film with. Uh, but yeah, the new place is two bedrooms. So I can give you that much information. Here was one bedroom or is one bedroom. But yeah, apart from that, uh, but yeah let's get into it so i have a few errands to run i've literally just gotten off bed and um let me hold you guys i'm about to go and pour the food i cooked i made sweet potato porridge yesterday so i want to go pour that in a bowl hey god i've packed all my bowls now i think there's one more bowl i need to pour it in a bowl to put in the fridge okay and then i can run errands because there'll be nothing worse than the food spoiling it's a bit hot these days i think it's a bit chilly today but yesterday was really hot so when it's all the food spoils very quickly but anyway i've been on for like five minutes at this point my whole house is a mess and i'm not even apologetic about it because are you moving if your house is not upside down at this point am i even recording <laughs> oh yes i am but yeah i guess you guys can see snippets everywhere it's it's crazy i'll just show you what i cooked quickly let me open the blind um but yeah, how are you guys doing? That's annoying because I need to go out. There's a car blocking my car, a kind of. But um, as I was saying, how are you guys doing? I'm just, I mean, that space where I've decided like things happening in my life will stay private. Like, I don't know. I'm just in that edge space at the moment but like sit down videos if you have questions about migration see i've always said it if you need your questions answered ask them on youtube youtube gives me notification like oh someone has left a comment whereas for why do i feel like this thing has cut off my head whereas for instagram i don't see it until i go into my dms and honestly a lot of times i go in and i run out because it's a lot. I'm just one person and I have so much going on right now, especially with moving houses, setting up and just surviving adulthood as always. But anywho, I shall talk to you guys later. Let me just show you. I'll take you guys around basically with my errands. I'm going to came out. I'm going to ship loads. I need storage and a few things for the new place. And that is one of the expenses I talked about where it's like you have things set up in the place you are now, but the new space is probably a little different and... You're gonna spend some money whether you like it or not so yeah that's what's happening now it's just been debit alert debit alert but i'm thankful to god for provision but at the same time i don't want to spend unnecessarily because i'll give you a gist of when i moved here how much i spent and how oh my god i don't want to think about it uh how i kind of went into debt but we're not talking about that i paid that off it was like a buy now pay later situation which stressed me out i'm not for that life mm -mm, no not again ever to come and help me move things i don't want to be overwhelmed when they move everything like if i don't start packing small small i'm grateful that i have a car you know so i'm able to put boxes in my car take it up to the new place and arrange in bits and pieces that has helped and i know that will help me settle in better when i get there because i can't like <laughs> i'm tired of being tired like i come back from work i pack and i just crash um totally exhausted i don't have time for any other thing in my life like literally so like i just want this phase to be over so in the next like two to three weeks i'm hopeful i'm fully moved in and then we'll see what life has in stock for us i know it's good things only but yeah let me pack this food up this is like the only bowl i have left in this house which is going to be interesting because i don't put food with pots in the fridge so i need to improvise okay but yeah We'll go out together today. I'll try and vlog, okay? Bye.
that is useful for me some of the stuffs are more expensive and as i'm trying to save money i'm going to kmart instead but yeah shiploads is just right opposite so i'm gonna go there bye Fourteen ninety-five. do you have any Hi guys, it's a few days later and I have a um, voiceover because of copyright music. I went in to reject shop just to, I went in for Ghana Must Go and I was able to pick it up. But Ghana Must Go is the way at this point in time because packing is just stressful on its own. Anything that will relieve me of stress, that's what I'm after. So I looked around a little bit. I saw a few, um, like jewelry, I saw a jewelry box. I saw like an egg um, case. And a few other things. I didn't buy anything else other than the jewelry box. That's what I came in here for, okay? We are sticking to the budget. Because I really just have a lot of teeny tiny things that do not fit in a box nicely. So I've decided to use Ghana Must Go for them. Um, or Checkered Box, if you call it that. But Nigerians know it's Ghana Must Go. But yeah, um, that is all. And yeah enjoy the rest of the vlog i was just running my mouth here as usual <laughs> bye i've been looking for this for a while but where it will fit in my fridge 37 by 11.5 huh. oh, just scattered one i have a sheen order to return that's one but i'll return that on my way i should have changed my shoes 
I returned that on my way home. I need to pick up something first from my friend's place. Secondly, find lunch because I really don't have food at home. Like I said, I have one pot. <laughs> I have one pot and uh, if I don't have pot, I have frying pan. So I need to actually go and uh, eat lunch. I just want like pancakes to be honest. Like seriously, that's that's what I'm after. Something like pancakes this afternoon. Why is this one blocking road now? Okay. Uh, what else? I need to go vacuum the new place put up the curtains again like the madness i've been through trying to move houses i will sit down and explain later because i cannot i uh, know my eyes it has seen it i've been through it i've gone through it <laughs> guy moving houses just calculate extra expenses things you did not plan for that you will spend on like just get get, get ready for it it's quite loud. This person should go. Let me go. Uh, but yeah, I don't have my mic. My mic it's already in the new house. So <laughs> until I move in, before you guys will get mic, but you guys should be able to hear me pretty okay. Let me wind up. Uh, what else? I need to finish packing. Like I said, the movers are coming tomorrow morning so i really really like they'll be there at my current place between eight and nine and i want them to literally pack everything tomorrow because the new place is upstairs and it's just hilly and uh, i've been stressed and i'm just like if i'm paying someone to come and do the job <laughs> best believe they're gonna do it they're gonna do it to the t so that's the plan uh uh that's why i bought ghana must go like i just have things that are annoying in the sense that they are all just scatter scatter so i want to dump everything inside ghana must go i'll go and sort myself out later it just needs to meet the deadline of tomorrow morning so if they come early they are booked in for two hours and um that's about it but anyway i'll talk to you guys later okay let me concentrate all right not that i'm not you know i'm i'm a, I'm, I'm an expert father lord please I saw me, I saw me, but let me, let me stop talking. Bye, guys. <laughs>